In this video, we are going to discuss source-free RC circuit. RC circuit is basically a circuit that consists of resistors and capacitors. And these circuits uh, find various applications in electronics, communication, and control systems. Let's draw the circuit first. Here is a switch and a capacitor and a combination of two resistances that are in parallel. Voltage source is 24 volts. Here is 6 ohms resistor and a switch and the switch will open when T is equal to 0. When the time is equal to 0, the switch will be open and for a long time when the time is less than 0, the switch was closed and as the switch was closed, so the capacitor gets charged through the 24 volt voltage source. What we have to find is the voltage V across the capacitor at time T greater than 0. When the time T is equal to 0, the switch gets open. And when the switch gets open, then we have to find the voltage across this capacitor. The second thing we have to find is the energy stored in the capacitor when the time T is equal to 0. So it is Vc0. So these are the two parameters that we are going to find for this circuit that is given. Let's move to the solution. We have two cases when the t is less than 0 and when time is greater than 0 and for both the times we will find voltage across the capacitor. So the case 1 is so when the t was less than 0 the switch is closed and when the switch is closed the capacitor gets charged by 24 volt voltage source and it will act like an open circuit to DC as it will not allow any current to flow. Let's redraw the circuit with the capacitor is open circuited and the switch is closed. So here is the voltage drop across this open circuit when the time is less than zero. Again simplify this circuit by removing this branch where there was capacitor that is open circuited and we will have a circuit with a voltage source and a combination of resistors so this 12 ohm and 4 ohm resistors are in parallel so we can find the parallel combination that is 12 into 4 over 12 plus 4 that is 3 ohms again simplify the circuit with 24 volt source 6 ohm resistor and replacing the 12 and 4 ohm resistor by their equivalent that is 3 ohms we have to find the voltage across this 3 ohm resistor because this resistor is parallel to the capacitor and we know that a voltage is same in parallel so 3 ohm is basically a combination of 12 and 4 ohms that are in parallel to the capacitor so we have to find vt when time is equal to 0 so it will v0 across the 3 ohm resistor that is basically the voltage across the capacitor so vc0 voltage across the capacitor at t is equal to 0 is by using voltage division 3 over 4 plus 3 into vs is equal to 24 volts and we get voltage across the capacitor as 8 volts let's move to the case 2 for time t greater than 0 and the switch gets opened and the capacitor has initially charged when the time was less than 0. So when the switch gets open at t is equal to 0, this whole portion will be cut off from the circuit or disconnected. So the voltage source Vs will be disconnected. When the switch gets open, this only this portion will remain the capacitor and the combination of 12 and 4 ohm resistors that is equal to 3 ohms. So we have a capacitor and an equivalent resistance in the circuit and this has become the source free RC circuit because it has no independent source and the capacitor is charged 
to V naught that is equal to 8 volts. So to find time constant R equivalent into C is equal to 3 into 1 over 6 that is 1 over 2 seconds. The voltage is Vt that we have to find. From previous video we know that the voltage response of RC circuit is an exponential decay of the initial voltage and the formula here is Vc0 that is equal to 8 volts E minus T over tau is equal to 1 over 2 and the final equation becomes voltage that we are asked to find across the capacitor when time was greater than or equal to 0. This was the part 1 and the second part is we have to find the energy, the initial energy that is stored in the capacitor and we know the formula for this is Vc0 at time t is equal to 0 1 over 2 Cv0 square so 1 over 2 capacitance is equal to 1 over 6 and voltage across capacitor at t less than 0 is equal to 8 volt and here comes the square by solving this we will get 5.333 joules and that is equal to the energy that is stored in the capacitor when the time was less than zero so that's all